e-cigarette, you get your nicotine fix without the ash and the par and the tar and the pine and the actual secondhand smoke that you would get, you know, with the tobacco cigarettes. In tonight's Healthier Me, a new study says e-cigarettes are safer than regular cigarettes. But can e-cigarettes increase the risk of teens choosing to light up and smoke? Valley News team's Joseph Ojo talked to a local vape shop owner today and has our story. With more than 37 million tobacco users in the U.S., many are giving up cigarettes for electronic ones for the belief that they are less addictive and safer. A study from the Royal College of Physicians says e-cigarettes can prevent almost all the harm from smoking and is not a gateway to smoking. Better just because there's no smoke. You know, it's, it's vape. Um, there's no tar, there's no ash, there's no pine. Um, you know, you don't have to worry about, you know, your teeth or your clothes, you know, or, um, just, or just your overall smell with these. So why are people flocking more towards e-cigarettes? The study out of England finds vaping to be 95% healthier than smoking the traditional tobacco cigarette. But while still addictive, e-cigarettes can hook teens and young adults potentially raising the number of conventional smokers if they start vaping. In vape shops like Sports Vape in Fargo, owner Darius Enders checks IDs to make sure vaping products are kept out of the hands of youth. While he does believe vaping is the much better alternative, he believes it is better for adults with the health benefits. If you, you, if you were to talk to many of our customers, people, people will say they now breathe better. You know, I have two, two kids myself and just playing with my little girls, you know, I don't get winded when I go up and down the stairs anymore now because of what vaping has done for me. But with e-cigarettes becoming popular, the long-term risk still remains unknown. In Fargo, Joseph Ojo, Valley News Live. All ingredients in e-cigarettes are approved by the FDA.